guys, welcome to Shame Time, episode 13, Persona 3. Right now, I feel a white-hot rage that I cannot, I cannot escape. I tried to record this episode, I started trying to record it an hour and a half ago, and I got through 15 minutes before somehow the recording caught on fire and I had to reset it. So I was going to originally put up the first 15 minutes, which is all I had recorded, as a separate video and say part one. So I thought like, man, normally an hour video takes less than 10 minutes to render. It'll be fine. It took an hour for those 15 minutes to render. And then right before it finished rendering, the goddamn capture card program crashed and I lost all that footage. So now I will recount to you what occurred. Well, we can talk to Junpei and he'll be like, oh, I told you it wasn't a good idea. Shinjiro helped us out though. And you're like, what is that, Manny? I'd never played this game before. I don't know what happened there. Well, we went to school. Uh, we hung out with Chihiro, but she didn't want to get a social link level up. So we just studied in the library. And then Yukari, Junpei, and I took a little stroll to behind the station where all the punks hang out. Uh, because we wanted to ask about the ghost story. Junpei got punched in the gut. Uh, Yukari talked a bunch of shit and then they were gonna pummel us, but Shinjiro came, headbutted a fool, and stopped them from doing that. He then let us in on the ghost story. Uh, so what was happening is there were girls who have been, uh, hurt and hospitalized and they, uh, were bullying Fuka Yamagishi, the girl who Akihiko said is a Persona user. Um, and people believe that Fuka may be dead now, uh, because she's been missing for a week. Whereas Junpei and me and Yukari thought that she was just sick from school, but turns out she's been missing. So, that's caught up. Uh, also... Chihiro invited me to hang out on Sunday. Uh, I declined because I remembered that I was to hang out with Yuko. So we will hang out with Yuko now. I believe anyways. I believe that was a Sunday, Sunday fair. Oh. Cannot believe it. I was tr I've tried so hard not to lose anything, but I, for some reason, made a save after that had happened and... Now I can't go back. So I apologize. Woof. And now, since the capture card was, like, exploding so much, I have no idea if this is going to have synced audio, so that'll be really fun for me to find out after the fact. I'm meeting someone today. It's about time to leave. Polonia Mall, accessory shop, B Blue V. You're having a good time with Yuko. I like this one with the cute little animals on it. Yuko is looking at some silver jewelry. This one with the heart on it is a little more feminine, but everyone has heart-shaped jewelry. Yuko can't seem to make up her mind. Which one do you like better, Manny? I like the one with the animals. Yeah, I agree. I like this one better, too. It's cute and not so ordinary, but today I'm just window shopping. Yuko seems cheerful. Today you became a lot closer. Your relationship could become stronger soon. Nice. Oh, man, and the last previous recording, you guys missed out on a lot of fun where I was using my DualShock 3 and it was randomly pushing triangle every so often and randomly advancing the dialogue every so often. It was really just super great. Very pleased by the whole scenario. Oh, my God. Ugh. This program crashes again and I lose this one. It's it's over. Sleep earlier because we're going to have an event. A full moon. You recall the story you heard at the outskirts of the station. You decide to ask the teacher about the missing girl, Fuku Yamagishi, today. Oh, 
It's Uru Senpai. Why are you here? Same reason as you. Mr. Ikoto, I'm here to ask you about a student named Fuka Yamagishi. No! I... I never thought it'd turn out like this! Fuka... Wait, you're that girl! What did you do to Yamagishi? Hold on, Mitsuru. This isn't an interrogation. Matsuki, you don't have to say anything if you don't want to. You wouldn't want to give her the wrong idea. Fuka, she... She always looked so frazzled whenever I gave her a hard time. And then... I realized... She's an honor student, but... Deep inside, she's just the same as us. I knew exactly which buttons to push. We were just messing with her that day, too. May 29th. We took Fuka to the gym and locked the door from the outside. Ah, uh, boy. Yep. What? You locked her in? That night, Maki returned to school alone. She was afraid we'd get in trouble if Fuka committed suicide. Yeah, probably. But she never came back. And the next morning, she was found lying on the ground by the gate. I went to the gym to let Fuka out, but the door was still locked. So I opened it and went inside, but she wasn't there. We all freaked out. Starting that night, we went out looking for her. But every night, another one of us went missing, and they each ended up like Maki. I see. By the way, Mr. Ikoda, all this time, you've attributed Yamagishi's absences to illness. But in reality, she was missing. You must have been aware of that. What was your intention? I was thinking of the students, of course. <gasps> what? You children may not understand, but we have to consider the future of everyone affected. What? You mean you chose not to report this to the police for the good of the class? It it was in her best interest. I don't think that's I mean, accurate. Her records to be stained by something like this. Her parents agree. So to protect your career, you ignored your responsibility as a teacher. How despicable! I agree. I I I, I didn't. I I was just uh... about your friends. Did you notice anything unusual before the incidents? Anything at all? They all heard a voice, a creepy voice, right before each of them went missing. They said it was calling their name. Oh, man. Oh, senpai, could it be? It's them. No doubt about it. Until now, there was no way of knowing how or why some people are conscious during the dark hour. But it's the voice. It draws them in. It's not a random phenomenon. This whole thing has made me realize they're clearly targeting humans. Shadows are the enemy of mankind. We're seeing this all right next to the teacher. Stay at our dorm tonight. It's the safest place. If you hear the voice, tell us immediately. And don't leave the room no matter what. If you can do that much, you should be okay. Don't worry. Yamagishi should be alright as well. We'll meet after school in the student council room to discuss tonight's operation. T tonight We're going to rescue Yamagishi. If my guess is right, she's still inside the school. I remember this one. I think this one's really cool. All set. Tonight, we will infiltrate the campus. Our objective is to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. Um, I don't get it. Is Fuka inside the school somewhere? And why at night? At midnight, this place turns into... Boom, Yukari's got it. Exactly. That's how Yamagishi wandered into Tartarus. Then, ever since Fuka got locked in the gym, she's been stuck there? But that was ten days ago. That means... Not necessarily. We can't jump to conclusions. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour. So...
So what about the rest of the day? Now that you mention it... This is only a theory, but I think time may function differently with respect to Tartarus. So, even though it's been ten days for us, perhaps only ten hours have passed for her. It's possible she's still alive. Wow, you think so? Uh, but the dark hour is pretty brutal. We could barely handle an hour. How's she gonna last ten? That's true. And even if she's still alive, we might not be able to get to her. Are you just gonna let her die then? Oh, jeez, Akihiko, calm yourself. I have an idea. Let's try to enter Tartarus exactly how Fuka did. We'll go to the gym and wait for midnight. That's the quickest way. Is that really gonna work? Honestly, I have reservations. If something goes wrong, you could all end up lost in Tartarus too. But oh, we're fine. I won't stand by and do nothing if there's a chance we can save her. I'd never forgive myself. If you guys don't want to go, then I'll go by myself. Senpai? All right. We're aware of the risks, but we can't just leave her there. I agree. And we won't know until we try. Cool. We get to sneak into the school. <laughs> In that case, I know just what to do. Class has ended. Okay, so Chihiro didn't want to hang out before. Oh, it's Monday, so she won't want to. I think we can hang out. Ah, oh, Yugo's not here either. Dang. I think Kazushi should be fine now to go up a level. Hey, bro. It's time for practice. You go on ahead. Kazushi doesn't seem like himself. Catch up later. You don't see Kazushi. After finishing the training, you decide to go back to the dorm. Oh, that makes sense. I wouldn't be able to hang out with Yuko because she had practice. Main lobby. You see Kazushi. Hey, Manny. What's up? You've probably been wondering where I've been. Hospital again? You remember when we talked about last time? Of course you do. You remember everything. Kazushi seemed a little happier now. I just got back from the hospital. They had the results from my last exam. Hey, Manny, I... Ugh. Damn it, I can't. Thanks, Manny. Sorry to be such a pain. Kazushi seems happy. Funny, huh? I was trying to tie my shoes and I fell. It's a good thing you were around. If it had been someone else, then the rest of the team would have found out. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Kazushi seems appreciative. Your relationship is stronger now. Mysterious voice rings in your head. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the Chariot Arcana. Woo! The Kendo Team social link has reached level 5. Your power to create blah 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 blah. I'm gonna go train by myself. I have to train even though practice is over. The big meet's not that far off. You're leaving, right? Later, dude. Let's train together sometime. You decide to go back to the dorm. gonna get real what's wrong I can't get a hold of the chairman I guess we can handle it ourselves there's one problem though without the chairman's help I'm not sure how we can get inside the school sneak in no need to worry I've got it all set to go set to go an explosive <laughs> <laughs> all right I'll let you handle this we don't have time to waste. Let's go. I wish Junpei had explosives. That'd be dope. An explosive? For real? Nah. All I did was unlock a door. Mm -hmm. 
be a way better scene See, if Junpei made a pipe no bomb. Man, I'm a genius. Is that really something to brag about? So you unlocked it earlier. Très bien. Oh, no time boy. for compliments. Let's go. What's the big deal anyway? Trey Ben, what's that mean? <laughs> Not English, is it? Trey Ben. Uh, can we turn on the lights? Oh, you scared? Uh, no, Stupe. Hmm. Stop calling me that. Trey Ben, Stupe. Quiet. It's better if we leave them off. They cut the power at night anyway. I don't like sneaking around. First, we have to find the key to the gym. Akihiko and I will check the janitor's room. You three check the faculty office. After that, we'll meet in the main hallway. Got it? The faculty office, huh? Hey, maybe we'll find some test questions. <laughs> maybe I should go to the faculty office too. It sounds interesting. <laughs> Akihiko needs those test questions. Are you planning something unscrupulous under my supervision? If so, then expect to be severely punished. It, it was a joke! I'd never do something like that. <laughs> Come on, Mitsuru. Line up a little. Fine. Let's head over to the janitor's room. Iori, you're coming with us. Let's get this over with. And then we just do whatever? Okay. It's a cool effect. With the light there. So we have to go to the faculty office? Do you hear that? The footsteps are getting closer. Th there's someone else here? The footsteps faded away. I remember doing this like really late at night. Uh, when I first uh, played this game and being like kind of creeped out by this scene. text messages it took me by surprise oh <laughs> yeah tell her she's cute it's not funny it was kind of funny okay No, no, it's so dark. I can barely read these. What does it say on this one? Really? Uh, I see. guess you could say Morg to be a dick to her. Yeah, this is it. Mind if we borrow this? Obtain Jim Key. Okay, also, who is she asking? Go. We're supposed to meet them in the main hallway. Did you find the key? Sure did. 
You know, I heard a scream that sounded kind of familiar. What? <laughs> you actually did? I was just kidding. You want to make something of it? Keep it down. We'll divide into teams again. Three of you will enter Tartarus, and one of you will remain outside with me. Once the dark hour has begun, I'll determine Yamagishi's position. I'll go. You should come too. You can take the lead, like always. Do I get to pick between Yukari um, and Junpei? Because, be yeah, I was going to say I better pick Yukari. Wait a second. Yeah, I would have left Junpei. I accidentally screwed up on the monorail? Give me a chance to make up for that. Oh, come on. It's not always about you. Besides, you didn't accidentally screw up. All right, Junpei, we'll give you another what? shot. What? God damn it, Akihiko. Sweet! What's wrong, Yukari? You don't want to stay behind with Mitsuru? Um, no, it's fine. I'm not fine with it. She's the healer, you dumbasses. It's almost time. I mean, I know Akihiko has Dia, but like, come on, man. Ugh. Come on, game. How are you gonna do me like that? I... I'm all alone after all. Fuka. me I I have to go tell her I'm sorry Fuka um we still haven't heard back from them the transceiver sensitivity is set to high too Oh yeah, that girl, Natsuki? I hope she's okay at the dorm. Unfortunately, no place is completely safe in the dark hour. But we couldn't possibly bring her here, and one of us staying behind was out of the question. Yeah, I guess so. Hmm. They don't really but like each other we're much. All here for Fuka's sake. This is Mitsuru. I've confirmed your position. You're higher up than I expected. You're barely in communication range. Is everyone all right? Akihiko! Come in, Akihiko! Is he out of range? I'm starting to get worried. Yeah, maybe you should come up with us. Yeah, so they get separated. As you could tell from Akihiko's message. You open your eyes. Your mind feels fuzzy. You wonder where you are. Are you awake? Ooh. This is the first time we've spoken outside Oops. of your room. I almost just said his name. Because I know what his name is, but maybe I shouldn't say that at this point if you've never seen the game before. Don't worry. You'll see them soon. But we don't have much time to talk. Tonight, there is more than one ordeal you must face. You should hurry. She's waiting for you. You guys will need her. Okay, then. I hope we can speak again. Communication is breaking up. Are you all right? Distance too far. Can't... Burp, 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 burp. Communication has been lost. I'd rather not fight anything. Uh, I don't remember what this shit was weak to. Where's Alp? There she is. My girl Alp. Oh, 
Oh, great. So we still don't know what it's weak to. Very unhelpful. Okay. We just keep trading like this until it's dead. I guess. Good. I could have died right here. Oh my god, I did. I think I did. Son of a bitch. Okay. A buttload of magic. Wonderful. Communication is breaking up. Akiko and the others aren't on this floor. Who's there? Are you human? Says the mysterious voice. Communication is breaking up. What's your current location? Reply immediately. Where am I? Why am I here? Please answer me. Communication has been lost. I don't want to fight anything by myself anymore because I know I'm going to die and then rage. Communication is breaking up. Can you hear me? Please answer. Is someone there? Please answer me. Communication has been lost. Okay. Woo. Woo. Hey, here he is. Man, we were worried about you. I don't think we should enter Tartarus this way again. Oh, yeah. Did you hear a voice while you were in here? Uh, kind of like... Who is this? Are you human? That's it! That's the voice! And here we go, guys. Sounded like a oh, this voice. I cannot stand it. Are you Fuka Yamagishi? Wow, you're alive. That's awesome. Never fear, June pays here. I'm glad you're okay. Come with us. Thank you so much. I she just, she sounds like a monotone robot, and I, I cannot stand her voice. I Looks don't like really like her decision. much as a character. I mean, Don't she's fine, but Mitsuo. God, her voice. Ugh. It grinds me so bad. Where are we? I was at school, and then... Well, it's a long story. I'll explain after we get out of here. Mitsuru, can you hear me? <sighs> no good. All I hear is static. Oh, yeah. Are, are you hurt? Have you uh, run into any monsters? So there are strange creatures in here, then. I've managed to avoid them so far. Are you serious? How's that possible? Um, it, it's hard to describe, but I can sort of tell where they are. What do you mean? Are you psychic? She has the same power as Mitsuru, maybe even stronger, since Mitsuru's persona is more battle-oriented. Hang on to this. <gasps> but... but this is... Think of it as a lucky charm. It's not really a gun. I think this is like the first time that they tell anyone that it's not really a gun. Alright, let's get out of here. I don't, I don't know if they ever explain in the actual game like what the evoker is, but it's like, it's a fake gun used Whoa, to bring out the persona. Like, the I, that sounds really dumb, but 
I've never seen it so bright. It's basically... I, hopefully they explain it in the game, because my train of thought won't allow it right now. that the shadows are affected by the faces of the moon. Of course, the same can be said for humans. That would explain Yucatan's mood swings. Hey, wasn't it a full moon the night we went to the monorail? Was it? I think so. Yes, it was. My. Hey, did you see the moon on the night the dorm was attacked, back in April? Mitsuru, are you there? They getting attacked. Hey, Mitsuru? Mitsuru! This is a cool scene though with the moon outside of Tartarus. What is this thing? It's much bigger than the others, and it's attacking someone. Damn it! What's going on? It's one of them. If my guess is right, they come every full moon. We have to hurry. Hey, hey, wait for me! What in the world? There's two of them. Mitsuru! Uh-huh. Oh, what's going on? Nothing's oh. working. Oh shit. Is this king pissed. and empress probably? Hey, isn't that Why the hell is she here? <laughs> it's popping uh, off. Uh, more Yamasan? Wait, what are you doing? Please, get out of here! It's dangerous! I... I wanted to tell you I'm sorry. <gasps> Wait! That's not a weapon! I know! There it is, Fuka's persona. Mitsuru. The crazy weird glass body dress thing. I'm all right. Be careful. Normal attacks won't work on these shadows, and all of our instruments have been destroyed. Just stay still. Besides, I can see. Is that the voice? I. I can sense these monsters' weaknesses somehow. Yeah, yeah. For real? Just as I thought. Mitsuru, let her take your place. I get it now. Yamagishi, can you assist the others? I'll do my best. Stay back, Mitsuru. We'll take care of this. See, I wonder if... The same thing is going to happen in Persona 5 because uh, in Persona 3 here, you originally start with Mitsuru and, find out the and she turns Just over the like, I don't really know how to describe it, the like, kind of like battle organizer role. And in 4 it starts as Teddy and then switches over to Rise. Just give me some time.
No, he's weak to everything. Oh man, we could kill him. Oh, he's weak to everything. Nice. See, what is this? This seems easy as hell. Too soon, I think. Okay, just give me some time. If we all go before him, he's right, toast. Yeah, pretty sure. No, Junpei! Why do you always miss? Come on, Aki, he go. Multiple weaknesses. Okay, just give me some time. He blocked it. Like oh it man. Seems like strike attacks will work. Yeah, my boy. Akihiko. Oh my god, get blocked. I've been waiting for this. Yo, of course we do. Oh, this makes me feel so good. After how infuriating the last stupid boss battle was. He blocked it, bud. How did they know? Impressive. Yes. I've been waiting for this. Wow, this boss battle was easy. And I say that before I win, but I'm just gonna we're just gonna assume. Ooh, bewildered. Oh, I missed. Oh, it's okay. I think the boss is dead. That's your chance. Go. Can you go? Yeah, boy. Mm. That was amazing. That's what we're talking about. We barely even got hurt. I don't even know that we did. Yeah, level up. Even Alp leveled up, huh? Ooh, we gonna learn Mudo? It's an instant death. Not that we should use Mudo. Are there more of them? Don't worry, it's over. Buka, are you all right? Yeah. Thank goodness. Fuka? It's all right. She's just exhausted. Fuka? Fuka, I... Where did these two shadows come from? From somewhere outside of Tartarus, just like before. I see. Um, what are we gonna do about Natsuki? She saw the dark hour and the shadows. Don't worry, she's not like us, so she won't remember any of it. The good news is, she didn't fall victim to the shadows. See, this is what makes no sense. Call. Because the regular people don't remember it, if they don't have personas, then why wouldn't they just bring Natsuki with them she in the first be place? Safe from now on. But that means she'll forget Fuka saved her life, right? That doesn't seem fair. Actually, I don't think it'll matter. <laughs> I'm sorry, Fuka. I'm so sorry. I think she's learned her lesson. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, 
It wasn't easy, but you managed to rescue Fuka. Your team survived another dangerous fight. It seems the trust between you has grown. You learned a new tactic. You can now use knockdown. Thank God. Oh my God. You wonder about the mysterious boy who appeared again. His warnings seem to be more than just dreams. You're too exhausted to make any sense of it right now. You decide to rest as soon as you get back to the dorm. Then it's time for school. You've become tired, of course. Hey, I was thinking, do you think Mitsuru Senpai saving f was saved Fuka because it was the right thing to do? Or was it just because she's a Persona user and we need her? For the right reasons. I guess so. Well, whether or not she joins us is up to her. Sorry to bring this up out of the blue. Yeah, Yukari's like weird hatred of Mitsuru is... I don't know. It's kind of weird and catty. Yo, who wants to chill? Chihiro? Oh, Manny-san. Hello, I was, uh, thinking. Yes? Um, I, um, uh... If you, um, get bored, then, uh, maybe we could, uh... Never mind, bye. Chihiro seems extremely nervous. You should talk to her after school. Yo, and Kaz, again? He's ready for round two? Hey, Manny, are you gonna practice today? Haven't decided. Because I'm going to hang out with Chihiro. I'll definitely be there. Be a little late. Don't worry about my need later. And since there's practice, we can't hang out with Yuko, so I should definitely hang out with Chihiro. You'll get, you'll get your time to shine someday, teacher lover. Yep. You can go, except the upper. Um, yes, then, um, let's go somewhere for a while. <clears throat> Jiro seems happy. The Chagall Cafe. The rich aroma of coffee fills the air. The time flies while you sip your drinks. Is it just me, or is the air conditioning in here too strong? I feel lightheaded. I haven't been feeling well lately. I couldn't even finish my lunch today. Jihiro looks pale. I may have caught a cold. I'm sorry, Manny-san, but can we go to a drugstore? You agree to go to a drugstore with Chihiro. I'll go get some medicine. I'll be right back. She seems way too cheery for being ill. What's your hurry, girly? Going to your boyfriend's? What do you want? You just came out of the drugstore, right? What did you buy? Hmm? Hmm? Leave me alone. Go away. Manny-san. Who are you? I, I was just making sure she was okay, but, but I have to get going. My favorite anime is on now. I'm glad. I thought you were going to hit him, Manny-san. I wouldn't want you to, to fight because of me, but just now you were, um... You helped me, Manny-san, but I'm not scared anymore, but why am I still shaking? I don't think I should have done that. Manny-san, Chihiro seemed a little surprised. Thank you, I'm okay now. Why all of a sudden do I feel short of breath? Manny-san, I... Chihiro seems to truly appreciate your help. Your relationship is stronger now. Oh no, but I want to get with Yuko. So much just to eat. That's only rank four. We're already holding hands, man. Yugo's not even that far yet. Never held Yugo's hand. I really must be sick. I feel like my face is all flush. By the way, thank you for saving me today. Excuse me. Jihiro ran away blushing. You decided to go back to the dorm. So weird. I, I do not. Oh hey. 
Hitsuru Senpai and Akihiko Senpai are going to the hospital to see Fuka today. I wonder how she's doing. Oh, by the way, Ikutsuki san told me that the antique shop in Polonia Mall is open now. Maybe we should go check it out sometime. Uh, yeah, the antique shop is, uh, like an accessory shop. Oh, I heard that the antique shop at the Polonia Mall is reopening. Ikutsuki san said the owner would help us out. How the hell can an antique shop owner help us out? Unless she has this amazing item created a million years ago that can annihilate shadows. Yeah, I'm sure that's what it is. Just ignore him. But yeah, you should really check it out. Don't forget, it's located in San Polonia Mall. Mitsuru Senpai and Akihiko Senpai are both at the hospital checking up on Fuka. So we won't be going to Tartarus tonight. And yeah, because we need to sleep. And go to the bathroom. But yeah, that'll do it. Uh, we did the whole full moon event. Um, and we hung out with Chihiro. So it worked out. Uh, sorry that there will forever be those lost 15 minutes. That would have put this up just a little bit over an hour. Uh, yeah, I don't know. That's really infuriating. And I... I tried as hard as I could to get the footage back for a little bit, too, to see, like, if I could salvage the non-complete file, but it wouldn't even do that. And then the non-complete file was actually, like, a larger file size than these when they're over an hour long, so I, I have no idea what happened there. Uh, but thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next week. Uh, it'll probably be, like, a more laid-back week because there will be no real event. Uh, we'll just deal with, like, Fuka and that kind of stuff, so... Look forward to that next week. Peace out.